Hey guys, so I have a CGC unboxing to do today. Um, we got two packages in. We got these two. I've actually already listed one of these on eBay. So it's already going up. Um, it's already been on sale for, for a little bit, for like a day or so. Um, and uh, yeah, so let's get uh, let's get these old Spideys out the way. Um, I'm gonna send these to CGC. And uh, we'll see what they come back. Some of them have tape and stuff, so I don't know if they'll come back as a conserved grade or they'll get knocked, you know. But uh, we'll see. Let's get this uh, Dracula out of the way here. And let's start with, let me get my water out of the way first. And um, just to let you guys know, I did uh, send like a ton of, uh, uh, maybe like 14 ASM Campbell books this week. I did send them to uh, CGC. Um, so that should be fun. Just to pay the grading fees on that. And to... Uh, so there it is. Here, let's get the stand going. I've been selling books like crazy. You guys seen my video on uh, the one that I did where I kind of uh, was contemplating selling my whole collection and buying more Bitcoin. That's essentially what I've been doing, but I've also been sending a lot of books to CGC that I had raw and then a lot of duplicates. So I would sell the lower grade ones to keep the higher grade ones. So yeah, I apologize for the shoddy unboxing and the mess everywhere. I got boxes and shipping materials everywhere. This was a 9.8 pre-screen of uh, San Diego Comic-Con um, Campbell exclusive. Um, so they both came back 9.8. And let me just get them on the plastic. Turn it to the light there. So yeah, this is probably my favorite cover out of the bunch. This one in cover B. Um, so yeah, we got two. So there's the other one. So I already listed one and I'll be keeping the other one. Um, so let's put this here. And uh, let's keep unboxing, yeah. This is what I mean when I say I have like a ton of shipping materials. I'm just sitting here. I also have another uh, case. And just kind of my Funkos are here and stuff like that. But um, so yeah, I've just, I just have a mess, dude. I'm listing books and uh, selling books like crazy. As much as I can and going to work and doing my homework. And, So this unboxing should be a little more interesting. I know that um, lately, I, uh, the unboxings consist of like the Campbell variants that came out, A, B, and C, and then D. So now they should be a little more interesting. Um, and let's get to it. So this is an amazing Spider-Man. 529 and I'm kind of disappointed by this I really thought that this would get a 9.8 that's why I sent it in and um, I sent it in after these so I couldn't do a pre-screen on this but um, you know I pressed it with CGC or CCS whatever you want to call it 
and um, I'm still pretty happy about it. I mean, it's just gonna get sold. I have another copy that's raw. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna send in the raw copy with another submission, probably with the old Spideys. And then whichever is a lower grade, I'll list and just sell it. Um, and I didn't pay anything for the book. I think I got it. One of the copies I got in like a um, Civil War kind of bundle thing that I bought like <clears throat> fucking probably like four years ago now. So it's a what if 20. Out of the what ifs that um, have to do with Spider-Man getting married or not marrying Mary Jane or Black Hat. This is the one I don't have at all. And I'm just kind of bummed out it's a 9.6 because um, I have the other ones in 9.8s. So, but I am going to keep this one. I don't have this book at all. So I'll keep it until maybe the future where I can get a 9.8. Like send one in and, and get a 9.8. But yeah. Let's see what else we got here. Oh yeah, so Carnage Mind Bomb. So I'm not really sure what this book is worth. But I got it at my LCS. <clears throat> I just thought it was really cool. I actually read it. And um, yeah, so came back at 9.4. Um, I'm not sure how many of these are on eBay. But I probably won't sell that one. This is probably the most expensive book out of the bunch. And this is a web of Spider-Man 118. And a 9.8. And these are pretty pricey. I've seen these go up to 1,000. I've seen them go for as low as like 700, 600. It just depends on, I guess, what time and what day your eBay auction ends. Um, but yeah, these can get pretty pricey. I know they were going for a thousand maybe like way back before across the spider verse came out then after it came out they started going for maybe like 700 or so i know right now like go collect has them around 800 but that's not really very accurate i would say this book is probably worth around five or six hundred on a good day definitely 400 um for sure but yeah, this is the most expensive one out of the bunch. And uh, needless to say, I'm going to keep that. So I ended up buying... I don't know if it was this one or the other one. Um, but I ended up buying one for 150 And another one for... I think it was like... 75 or something. So... Needless to say... Um, <laughs> it came back a very, very good deal. Uh, so this is uh, a Spider-Woman 9.4. This book's not really that valuable. Um, and it's newsstand, but I think they were all newsstand at this point. Mo like 99%. Um, let's see here. Oh, this is the other one. Um, so this is 9.6. So this one will be going on eBay for sale. Man, I just love this fucking cover. And I love the character. Um, I'm not really happy with how they... Um, what they kind of did with him in Across the Spider-Verse. But, uh, yeah. This is a Madam Web, so a Spidey 210 and a 9.2. Not really valuable book. Um, just might end up keeping it until I can upgrade. What else we got over here? Oh, so this is the higher grade Spider-Woman. So I'll be keeping this one, and I'll be selling the 9.4. Not terribly valuable book. Even in a 9.8, I think this book isn't that... It doesn't have that much going for it. I mean, it's her first solo series, but it's like... It's not her first appearance. You know, that would be Marvel Spotlight 32. I think it's 32. And then we have a What If 21. 9.8 I already have one of these so I'll definitely be selling this one on my eBay but yeah I mean that was this unboxing guys if um, 
you guys want to check out some of the listings they'll probably be live by the time i upload this video and um yeah thanks for uh, checking out the vid and apologize for the mess but i've just kind of been all over the place right now um but yeah peace